Hey everyone, in this tutorial, I'll be showing how you can make this smooth X and Y slide transition in After Effects, so let's get started. This will be the X or horizontal slide transition. First, pre-comp your clips. Now add S underscore Blurmo curves on your clip and follow me. Press the clock icon of Shift X and copy my values. Or you can also use values of your own to change styles. Press U to bring up the keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. After that, follow my graph settings. Also select Reflect option on X Warp. The more you adjust the graph, the more faster will be the animation. The first clip is ready. Now add S underscore Blurmo curves to the second clip. Again, press clock on X warp and copy my values. Press U to bring up the keyframes and press F9 or right click. Select keyframe assistant and hit easy easy. Select Reflect on X Warp again. Select all keyframes and open Graph Editor. And now follow my graph. These adjustments make the animation smooth and faster. And we're done. The X slide transition is ready. To make it more smooth, we'll add directional blur. So take an adjustment layer and cut it according to the clip. I am using BCC directional blur, or you can just use the normal directional blur. Now copy my values. After this, we're going to make the same slide transition, but vertically, or the Y slide transition. Press U to see keyframes and F9 to easy ease or right click to easy ease. For the Y slide transition, the process is same but we'll select Shift-Y instead of Shift-X and follow my values. Press U to see keyframes and press F9 to easy ease. Select Reflect on Warp-Y. Select all keyframes and open the graph editor and follow the graph settings. Now add Blurmo curves to the second clip and repeat the process like the first clip. Again, we're going to use the directional blur, so take an adjustment layer and cut it. In the directional blur, we need to change the angle to zero degree for Y slide transition. Finally, the Y-slide transition is ready too. 